apartment in particular, one of the reasons we loved it on uh, what we saw on the internet was that it looked like it was open and airy, and indeed it is. When, um, the main main portion of the apartment, um, in the living area and the table are in open area rooms with windows on two full sides um, that look out over a big open space. There's no apartment building blocking your view, so it's nice and wide open and airy with plenty of light, a nice breeze going through it. Um, and it's beautiful. It's a very, very comfortable apartment to be in. And uh, it, yeah, it definitely made up. This is actually the patio of the apartment. And, and, and we love the terrace. The We're sitting outside on the patio on the terrace, which is quite unique in Barcelona to have so much space outside that's private. Um, this is a penthouse apartment on the top floor, and this is the patio. It's a beautiful uh, area, so the apartment was very nice, and uh, also the neighborhood. They were in the neighborhood of Pedralbes, and this is a very nice upscale neighborhood. And one of the things that drew us to it is it's more of a Spanish residential area, and for us being here for a month, we were really looking for a place that was more of a family area, and uh, I don't think we ran into very many, or if any, Americans or non-Spanish or Catalan people just in this neighborhood. So that's the beautiful part, and that's what we were looking for, is more of uh, uh, assimilating into the culture in the area. And this is a beautiful area, uh, accessible to downtown easily by the metro, and you can get a hang of the metro very quickly. Uh, but also, you're not in the middle of a tourist area, and when you go to the restaurants, it's more of an authentic and there's five or six pastisserias right on the block.